Right, so we're going to look at the multiplication cipher. With the cipher we take each of the characters and convert them to a numeric value depending upon their place in the alphabet and then we multiply by a, a fixed value and then we take the mod of 26. The only thing we need to watch for is that the value that we multiply the number by, the A value here, needs to be what's called co-prime, which means that it can't share a factor with 26. So the factors of 26 are 2 and 13, so we can't have any even numbers or we can't have 13. So those are the values we could use to multiply our values. Okay, so in this case we've got overhead, a multiplier of 5, and we've got to find the cipher. So I've laid out what the values of each of the characters are, so we'll just go ahead and we'll multiply by that, and then take mod 26, so it's 14 times 5 equals, and then we'll take the mod of 26, and we get 18. And we'll just see what 18 is, so 18 is an S. Okay, now we'll take 21. 21 times 5 equals mod 26 is a 1. So that gives us a, a 1 here, which is a B. And now 4. 4 is easy. 4 times 5 is 20. Mod 26 is still 20. So that becomes a U. 17 is a bit more difficult. 17 times 5 equals mod 26. Mod is used a lot in, in encryption and it's the it's the result of a of our of an integer divided to the remainder. So that becomes three. So three becomes uh where are we you each so that's a U just just let's check that seventeen so seventeen times five equals mod twenty six is seven. And a seven is an H and seven times five is thirty five mod twenty six is nine which is a G. Four again, that becomes a twenty, which is a U. Zero becomes zero because we multiply anything by zero and we'll get zero. So it stays as an A. <coughs> and D is three times five is fifteen mod twenty six still gives us fifteen. So fifteen gives us P. So I think the answer is if we read off there J U A P. That's the cipher there. And what we'll do is we'll just try that back to see if it works. Just uh so, 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 ah, so this is an A and it works. Okay? So that's how to do the multiplication cipher. Uh it's it's a Mod is a typical operator that we use, and uh, the the concept of the co-prime is also an important concept that we have when we're using the mod operator. Okay, thanks.